seeing my stained glass window hangings for the first time, a lot of people assume that the stained glass look comes from small strips of black fabric. Years ago, there was a common quilting technique called stained glass quilting that did use strips of black or sometimes other color bias that would go in between the pieces. However, this is not what's used in this method. In this method, the stained glass look is a combination of the seam technique and the sunshine. When you see one of my pieces not hanging in a window, you'll notice it doesn't have the stained glass look. It just looks like regular patchwork until you turn it over and see that it is reversible. There are not raw edges exposed on either side. And that's because the seam that is used is finished on both sides. You can see a tutorial for how to stitch this seam. But if you took home like a long time ago, or you come from the dressmaking world, you'll probably recognize it as a flat fell seam. I was inspired to use the seam in patchwork by Pojagi traditional Korean sewing, where they have a few different seam techniques for reversible patchwork. Patchwork that is one layer of fabric and it's finished on both sides. So the whole piece is reversible. But the seams in this technique have many layers of fabric in them. And in between the seams is only one layer of fabric. So when it's held in the window, the light shines through the one layer of fabric and it doesn't shine through the seam. That is what gives the stained glass effect. If you wanna try this technique, it's fun and easy to do. You can click below for tutorials and project ideas to get you started. I know you're gonna love it. For more quilting, pojagi, and embroidery ideas and tutorials, be sure to follow EBITDA Studio. Thank you.